spies and still keep looking for us. And old hag and a fucking team? Those were some mighty spies there, my friend. You sure? And then they just walked in here all by themselves, did they? A chopper brought them in and then squeezed it. Oh, yeah. Agent Egg reporting. Naturally, they're pretending to be civilians. You rookies all think you know everything after a week of service. Yeah, yeah, I don't know shit, I know. This place looks clear. Good. Still, we should stay away. Freeze of death here. Got the shivers. Now nah, we can survive the cold. Something else is going to show us up. Tell me, why are we here? Why? I guess we got to that door. Exactly. And how are we supposed to guard it? We can't guard it. Well, I'm good. I'm the gathering dust. I'm home. We'll be on gathering dust. I think I'm your test to bury the full out of the soap. We can try to stop the rest. We need all the good guns for the death line duty. Since we're safe here, they gave us what was left. That's all. Well, I'd better be in the front line, though. This is rustic garbage. So what? It can still shoot. Yeah, it can. But can it hit anything? Not even work like this. You win so crooked and worn out. What the hell? What were the lights? Uh, it's that breaker again, or something. Just keep shutting off. Is there any sense in sitting in the tower with no searchlight? Again? This just won't do. Let's get the workers to fix it. Now? There's a fucking alert going on. Nobody but the guards are allowed to move. Yeah? Well, do something about it then, or else you're up for a chewing out. I know. Well, See you go on the wherever tower. you're going. A patrol or something. <laughs> Where the hell did that come from? Oh. Oh. Looks like you can proceed from there, but be careful. Oh, <laughs> Attention! The command center came under enemy attack. The attackers are assumed to still be on the base territory. All unauthorized persons are to be fired upon immediately. Civilian personnel movement is prohibited until further notice. Watch out. There's a guard the on the tower. Is coming back Wait till the right moment. Just my luck, sitting at the very top, right under the jammer. Ah, shit. This thing could boil your brains.
setting and check the ravine. Yes, sir. Mm. Artyom, I got your back. Okay? Place to put the guard we have to get closer. If you get closer, I'll distract them while you rescue the old man. Yes, sir. Artyom, try going down that ladder ahead. Just be careful. Is somebody guarding Yermak? Yes, sir. Mika is watching him. Captain, sir. If I may have permission I'm to... I'm telling you, there was a noise from behind the gate. There's not. We'll find out. First, we handle the attackers. And then, we take time talking to you. Ah, oh, that's great. He's been acting way too suspicious oh, lately. Won't even get the chance to raise an alarm if I can jump here. So nice not to expect the bullet for a night. It seems there's Who's something that? down there. Who made that noise over there? Group A, report to your status. Group D, continue patrolling the hangar. Group A, okay, go check the courtyard and generator room. Communications were lost there. What if it's demons? I said they'd make all that noise about demons. When there's demons around, they are dead silent. They know better than to attract attention. When the demon up, I know those dogs. I hope go outside and see what's up there. Group D, redeploy to the wind turbine zone. Ah, you can see the head. No need to play heroes for a change. Let's wait till they walk off. I repeat, Group D, redeploy to the wind turbine zone immediately. Group B is under heavy attack from watchmen. Civilians aren't allowed to just walk around now. Doesn't that mean you're going to ready the train for me? What's the matter with you today? Why do you even want to do that now? You only had an outing plan for tomorrow, and it's bound to be cancelled now. Just stay put for now. We'll have to have a long talk later about breaking the rules. All clear. Am I glad to see you here? Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there Come and on, switch Jim. the turntable mechanism on. And please, be careful. We could easily have the whole base on us. Dear. I'm so fucking tired of this shit. It's the enemy! More guards! Get them! Let go, Artyom! 
That was intense. Are you okay? Hey, there's a manual drive on the platform. It's hard to Artyom. drive. It's just a little bit. Enemy! Let's do this together. Just a little. Yes. Run. Kill them. Come on. Yes. You should put the masks on! The seals might be damaged! We did it! Yeah! Over. Roger that, base. Over. All right, shoot these two. And as for the engineer... Oh, what do you mean, shoot these two? Don't Is this you the dare get me, Lynn Soldier. Dear, the Colonel will give you a piece of his mind now. Colonel, sir, we have a situation here. Honor! Dad! Guys! It's us! Help us! What oh, the no. hell? Oh, Guys, what are you doing here? Talk about sir. Colonel, this will mean court-martial for all of you. All right, everyone, shut up! I can't believe this. Just can't believe this. Shit! So this is true? You are working for them? The bastards shot Artyom! Be quiet! They... How did you end up here? Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. You have no idea what you just stuck your heads in. We've no moves left. Hansa can't take this line No down. shit, the watchers Sherlock. Won't let no, them. I won't be quiet. What is this jammer for? Why are they hiding the fact that Moscow didn't survive alone? There, what is in the ravine, about, there are so people from other cities, cities dead. All yeah, of them, women, up. children. I'll tell you all later. Everything. Gramps, what's going on out there? Down this road. The road is fine, at least until a hundred click mark. Is there a safe place to stop nearby? Of course. We have to make haste though. They called the cruiser. All right, gentlemen. Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess. And I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to not my this call and you're not misunderstanding. Well, I'll jam. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The no one behind. If He's not not a a All right, Spartans, throw these overboard and full steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch some air. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! While you were getting irradiated on the surface, my father just kept lying! Lying to you, to me, to everyone, the whole fucking world, and not even batting an eye! Uh? Stop 
the engine immediately and come out with your hands above your head. That was just a warning. If you do not comply, we will shoot to kill. Fuck me, that's some armor. And look at all the machine guns. Happy now? Is this what you are hoping How for? How is this his fault? You knew everything and never said shit. Yeah. 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 Stop the engine immediately! Oh fuck! Are you okay? Yeah, just a scratch! Okay, uh, okay, we are stopping! Uh, but I must warn you, our brakes are not in great condition! Yermak, start slowing down. Let them think we are surrendering. Ah, yes, finally some good sense! Now, keep braking to a stop! People. Well, grenades will barely scratch their pain, so... How about from the inside? Not enough explosives. Unless we put everything we have in their firebox. Please, let me do it, Colonel, sir. I will be appointing the volunteers here. Artyom will do it. Why Artyom? Because he started it all, and he better do something about it. Artyom, leap over as soon as we slow down. I will distract him in the meantime. We were going to go far, just out of town for a bit till the excitement quiets down. And you just go off and fire. Will you let us go if we stop? I have to detain you and bring you back to face trial. You do understand the charges you're facing, right? Desertion. Treason. Are you fucking kidding me? Me? A traitor? You tell me, where are you taking that train, huh? On a simple joyride? No, I see only one after you've been fought and you're running back to your masters. So the verdict has already been passed. We won't even see a trial. Cut that shit out. What are you carrying, man? Defense plans? You want to buy yourself a seaside retirement with a life, you damn cripple? Plans? Treason? We have served you people without question for years! We have spilled our blood for the cause! You sold out! They destroyed us and you! I have been a soldier my whole life! I have dedicated my life to my people, my country! But I'll be damned if I give it to parasites like you! He's going to be now. Damn, I kind of hoped it wouldn't get to this. You don't know? Some assholes stole an engine of ours and are trying to escape Moscow. So we are after them. Are they mad? Escape? Where to? There's nothing around. Damn, you are great. There are lots of things around we are just not supposed to... I tried to treat you 
Mr. Chomain, we! Why don't you want the trouble? I was just out of common courtesy to an ex-colleague. I thought you'd come in quietly and I could put in a good word on your behalf of the trial. Well, sounds good to me. But what about the order? Well, you'd be demoted, of course. But your subordinates are blameless in this. Oh, yeah! Sure! We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green, as if they're in a conspiracy. Still, this amazing piece of news doesn't really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to what to do next. And I, I'm just waiting for answers. And hoping the commander, whom until recently I trusted implicitly, is going to be extremely persuasive in his reasoning. Why their own faces? We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder. What next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. Hmm, so, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who are those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you uh, mean, what? did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, command chose the only viable course of action. To play dead. To ensure radio silence, the SHIELD system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. 
Could you not have shared that before? Say, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago under a strict you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh, Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. And look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned the Ark. What's that all about? If Artyom finds their signal, you'll figure everything out. Otherwise, there is nothing to talk about. Do you think finding that Ark of yours is going to fix everything? I do not. But if you have a better idea, then go ahead. Yes, I do. We have to find a good place for people from Moscow, like Artyom always wanted. Giving them all to the enemy? A grand idea. I say, we solve our problems before moving on to saving all Moscow, all right? How is it going, Artyom? Found it yet? There's a whole world out here! A world where we could live! So far, we only know one thing for sure. Radiation levels are nominal. The air is breathable. But what about the rain? So what? You can't even breathe in Moscow. So? Does anybody live out here? We don't know. How will they treat us? I don't know that either. What would they do if they found out there are survivors in Moscow? Again, I don't know. Keep looking, Artyom. It's got to be a signal. But we do know we've been lied to. For 20 years, we've been lied to. We know they've been killing people. Collateral damage is inevitable in operations of such scale and secrecy. Yes, people have died. But the bombs killed tens of millions. Yet we are alive. We stayed alive throughout those years. Artyom almost got killed. Is he just collateral damage too? Guess what? Yes! If you have to choose between the life of a single man, no matter how dear he is to you, and the lives of everybody else, all the dwellers of Metro, then there's nothing to think about. Are you looking for it, Artyom? Come on, do your best! Would you say the same about me? And about myself, too. I've spent my whole life protecting the people of Metro. Do you get it? My whole life. And I wouldn't hesitate for a second. I'm prepared to do anything to ensure Metro survives. Even though they'd shoot me on sight if I returned now, it doesn't matter. Too many lives are at stake. Too many lives have already been sacrificed to hesitate now. Too many. I'm sorry. I didn't want to. I mean, but we have to make up our minds. How will things finish for all of us if we start out lying to each other and arguing? We need to be better. You ask me how things will finish. Well, let me tell you, it all depends on Artyom now. If he finds the frequency, if they are alive. <sighs> Found it yet, Artyom? Please, try! It must be there! <sighs> Keep looking, Artyom. It's got to be a signal. <sighs> Found it.
found it yet, Artyom. Please try. It must be there. Wait a moment. What was that? Speaking from the Ark Project what? base. Everyone who can hear me. Well, everyone still you know, to the call. Listen, everyone. Proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code one eight one one dash seven nine. Area right. one eight dash five. I repeat. Where was that number Proceed supposed to? Proceed to the rally point. Rally point location <laughs> is code. What? So Eight. it is what? somewhere what? around Dash. here, Seven. the Yamantown Mountain. Area. So One. the route from here Dash. should go. Uh, Only by standing this. this is our goal. So, is this through. what you had in mind? Yes, this is it. The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work! We will tell them that Moscow is alive! It wasn't all for nothing! Everything will change! Everything! Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the world! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, by the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction! So, I think the moment calls for... <clears throat> Bring it out to me! Bring what out, Colonel? Sir? That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. But let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? Huh? It's about time! Let's go around and be done with it. <laughs> nah, go to hell! <laughs> Even better! Oh, come How on! How about Aurora? The Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what? That's better! <laughs> Not bad! I like it! Die, beautiful name! Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later! Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's trick to the Hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. You're back. Full steam ahead. Hi. Full steam ahead. Wow, oh, that, uh, that's sure, some distance. I wonder how long it will take. How are you, Alyosha? Oh, Anna. I was expecting an arrow from a Cupid, but I got a bullet from an ugly motherfucker instead. <laughs> <laughs> you sure you're okay? Because I know you. Just so you know, scars attract the ladies. And there's definitely a lot of those up ahead. I don't need a lot, really. It's quality that matters. It seems to me, whether it was intended or not, that our colonel now has a goal to strive for because of you. We all remember the way you fought back in D6, so no matter what lies ahead, we're with you. You can count on us. Yeah, yes. As for me, I'm running a little inventory check. Yeah, it is kind of cramped in here. I'm thinking of making something of a workbench. So that's all the instruments we get, and everything else would be within arm's reach. With no workbench, you just lose small components. We'll use this place to work on the weapons, cleaning, oiling, keep out of everybody's way, and keep them from messing with my stuff. Ah, well, we'll have to take turns, of course, but we'll manage. So, if you find any weapons you'd like to keep, I'll store them for you here on the Aurora, and you can come back to exchange them. 
You'll get them back in their best shape ever. Don't you doubt. Oh, boy, have I cleaned and oiled a lot of weapons in my life. Hmm, factory and homemade too. Some of those were just amazing. So unusual. So, if you have any weapon-related questions, I'm your man. And weapons, they are like girls. They need attention. You clean your weapon well, you oil it, you check the ammo, because these dirty ammo caps do get rusty sometimes. But if you put your heart into it, the weapon never fails. Ah, well, I'll just finish oiling this one, then start on another.